In this video, we're going to cover the options available in the Order Tracking plugin. To get started, head over to the Options tab. You can see that there are a number of free and premium options that can be used to customize the plugin. The first one at the top of the page is the custom CSS box. This can be used to alter the display of the tracking form for your customers. You can put in any custom CSS code that you'd like, and it should automatically override the default styling of the plugin. The next option is the most important one, order information displayed. These checkboxes can be used to select what information is displayed for all of the orders on your site when customers check them. Many of them are straightforward. Order number, name, and notes all display exactly the information entered through the Orders tab. Status Graphic displays a graphic which helps your customers visualize the progress of their order. Status and updated date show all of the statuses for an order and when they were entered. Customer Notes adds a form to the front of, end of your site so that customers can add information for you about their order. Finally, if you're using the premium version of the plugin and have created custom fields, there will also be checkboxes for those fields below the standard order information checkboxes. The option below, Order Form Instructions, lets you put in custom instructions for visitors about how to fill in the tracking form. These instructions will be displayed above the order form. The Set Time Zone option lets you set the default time zone for the plugin so that when you update an order status, it displays in the appropriate time zone for your business. The Date slash Time Format option lets you select the appropriate date and time format for when order statuses are displayed for your customers. Again, this is to suit the plugin to the location in which your business is located. Order Email Frequency lets you decide when emails should be sent out to your customers about their orders. On change means that the customer will receive an email each time the order gets a new status or other update. On creation means that an email will be sent out only when the order is first created. And never means that your customer will not receive an email about the order. If you're having trouble with this option, please see our tutorial video on orders, statuses, and email basics for tips on how to get emails set up correctly for your site. The next option, results display, lets you select how the results for the tracking form are displayed. This can either be using Ajax to display the results without reloading, displaying results in the same window, or displaying results in a new window. The last basic option is Order Email Confirmation, which lets you require users to enter their email address along with the number for their order before the results are displayed by selecting User Entered. Auto Entered option should only be used by advanced users who are able to code the email address into the form attribute dynamically. Premium users have the option of controlling which WordPress user level is able to access the admin area for this plugin. You can set this to any WordPress user type, but be careful that only users you trust are able to access the admin area, as they will also be able to edit this option. In the premium options, there's WooCommerce integration, where you can decide whether WooCommerce orders should automatically be created inside the order tracking plugin. Next, there's the order tracking graphic. You can choose between three graphics, including the default, which comes with the free version, the streamlined, and a sleek option. Finally, there is also the option to include a mobile style sheet so the tracking form is optimized for smaller screens. Check out the plugin page on our website for additional information or subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with future tutorial videos for this and other plugins.